Hello, in this video we are going to talk about the Wi-Fi scanner from the developer uh, Sequoia Sand and you could check his work in the description down below there is a link to his github address so here I have like an ESP8266 so it is flashed now with like the Wi-Fi scanner from his work and I'm going to show you here what we could do indeed and if there is any purpose for what you're like going to achieve with. So why I say like this, it's because like, you know, this uh, ESP8266 uh, works only on 2.4 gigahertz and if you have let's say uh, any android smartphone you could like download a wi-fi scanner app that will work on both 2.4 and 5 gigas so is there any sense here like for you to work with the flipper zero and use it as like a wi-fi scanner well it depends because like obviously here you could see I don't have like a prototype board and I'm like using like a lot of like wires so maybe it's less handy than yeah using your phone but in another way like if you don't want to use a phone for any other reason and here like definitely you could like use like a, an ESP board it's versatile in the fact that you could like use it for um, other projects, so not only like the Flipper Zero module, and there is also like the deauter board you could use it with. Okay, so if you want to use it here, like we need to use it um, with the five volt on. So I have turned like on five volt uh, for the, all the GPIO, so that's the first pin. When I turn it on, like you could see, like there is. A, the blue light uh, blink it briefly okay so uh, now when it's done I'm going to um, log in on the application menu and select GPIO okay and from here like I still wanted to um, talk a bit more about like the module so 8266 but it's also working on ESP32. So here, like the developer already mentioned, there is like better performance on the 8266. Also, what is interesting here, like if you need to only buy one of the board, it will be definitely interesting because you could use it with the deauter. So, and perform like um, attacks that will, um, disconnect like user from the access point okay so that's one that's if you want to like reflash the firmware of like the um, uh, ESP board and indeed use the same wiring so you could still like flash it while you have it uh, plugged in to the flipper zero and here for the ESP32, so that's maybe a complementary board if you want to use it with the marauder. So yeah, we will see that um, in another video. So let's go back to the Wi-Fi scanner. I select the application and now I'm going to launch it and we're going to see how um, we could like what we could do basically with the Wi-Fi scanner. So here, like you could see, it performed a scan. So all the information here, if I'm going to browse uh, the list, beside my um, HP wireless printer, there is like all my neighbor Wi-Fi. So I'm not going to like uh, expose them over like YouTube indeed. But what is interesting to know, it's like once you have scanned all this list, um, is 
on the application um, screen here. So until like you exit this application, you could like browse and check out what are like the um, wireless name, what does what is like the MAC address from the access point, like uh, the strength of the signal, the channel um, that is used, and the encryption below. Okay, so that's all the information. Now, what is interesting, like with like the strength of the signal, you could like uh, click on the OK menu here and enable like the monitor mode. So here you're going to have like on side of the screen uh, progress bar in one way and that's going to show you like the strength of the signal also and it's going to uh, be on live okay so thanks to this feature you could actually like let's say walk around with your flipper zero and try to find out where um, the signal is at its best so that's mean you could probably um, guess where the access point location is. Okay, so that's all like I will use um, this Wi-Fi scanner module. So stay tuned if you want to see more of my journey with the Flipper Zero and like trying out all the new feature and cool release that developers does do in in this uh, field thank you for watching 